what's up guys welcome to sam camp um today i'm just going to be showing you guys how to use this amazing library called tesseract which allows you to be able to extract image uh, text from images uh, it's something that i've been using in uh, one of the recent projects that i'm busy with and i think that this is something that uh, if you haven't come across you would appreciate to know about uh, especially for the fact that it's open source it's free and that's that's really nice and uh, as far as i know this was created by google okay so i'm just gonna uh go ahead um so this obviously this library is, uh, is for javascript only so let me just go on ahead and and uh, show you guys how this works and be in mind that this also works in the browser and also in node.js okay so i'm just gonna first initialize my project Ah oh, well, I just said npm. <laughs> Let's say init. Okay, npm init. Uh, I'm just gonna go on ahead. And yes, okay, I'm done with that. And what I wanna do is install tesseract. Uh, .js. Okay. Okay. So I have an image here, which is basically just. Uh, I don't know if it's gonna be visible it's basically just an i don't know it's just an image i don't know what it talks about didn't really read it just wanted uh, an image with some text on it this is what i got okay so we're going to be ex actually extracting the text from this right okay so first thing you want to do obviously is to bring in your library i'm just going to say t actually uh, require just like the gs now oh, let's leave the the braces. Okay, so this is where the magic happens with Tesseract, right? This is where it gets nice. So this thing actually simplifies your work and it th it makes things very simple and it's short. The code you write is really short for what you achieve. It's really amazing. Let me show you. Okay, so all I have to do is just say recognize. <laughs> That's all I have to do actually. Oh, not exactly all I have to do. Obviously, I have to specify uh, with arguments uh, which image I want to convert so our image is this one uh, the, it's here on the root directory okay so it's paragraph okay the, did i do okay paragraph png okay okay so that's the image we want to convert so what language is this image well it, this is in english right so we want to specify that as well then we have to specify some options um well, I just want to specify a logger just so it could uh, log stuff to the console and just show us the progress and those kinds of things. Right. And so I'm just going to say E here. I don't know what to call this uh, the variable here. So console.log E. Okay. And this returns a promise. So you can just say, okay, then when you're done, uh, just say out. So when you're done, we, s we basically want to console.log. Well, first, this is going to give us, um, how do I put it? Well, you'll see what kind of data it gives us. Okay. And then we're done with that. Let's see if this actually works. Node app. Okay. Well, you, as you can see, these are the logs here. Right. So these are the logs we're getting. Okay, it's still processing. It takes a bit of time depending on the size of the image. Uh, I think also the colors that are in the image, uh, those kinds of parameters actually matter, I think. So yeah, okay, it's at like 61%. Okay, as we wait for it, as it takes its own time, but uh, it's almost done, 25%, 77 I'll skip this a bit. Um, okay, so there it is. So I don't think I should skip it anymore. <laughs> okay, so here's the data we're kind of getting. Uh, well, it's, I don't know, it's just not readable mostly, but I don't understand what this is, right? So, but if I go up here, I think this is what we care about, the text, right? So we get the text. I think this is, what we all care about so the other stuff below i'm not so sure what that is but this is what i care about and it extracted the text 
so we could just basically go on here and say out dot um, dot data dot text for example right so that should make it simple for us just to give us exactly what we're looking for but i think uh by now you can realize that with uh three lines honestly speaking or two lines we could say we have been able to convert an image into text and that is really amazing to me and that's why i thought i should share this with you guys so if you like the video please hit hit a like um subscribe and you know just tell me and give me ideas on what kind of videos i could make okay um, i appreciate your eyes and you viewing this video thanks